This is how you add custom patterns to STLs in Bamboo Studio. First, you want to start by finding your STL file. This STL file here is of a camo pattern. Simply drag it into Bamboo Studio. It'll extrude it up and then export it out as an STL. Then you can go ahead and delete that. Now you want to drag in your model file. Once that's loaded, right click it. Then you're going to add modifier, load, and then you're going to pick the STL file of the pattern that you just exported. When it loads in, it'll probably be very off, like mine's is floating very high in the air. Simply click it, then you're going to click the move tab, and you can enter the dimensions of 000. That'll bring it closer to the model. Then once you have it there, hit the scale button and simply scale it and rotate it the way that you need it. Again, you can also use the move function to move it into place if you do not want it to go all the way through your item. Once you're happy with your position, click the object tab. Then from here, you can change which slot or which color it's going to use. Then you can slice it to get a preview. And this comes out pretty good. But if you want to add another color using the same pattern, you simply go back. You're going to click on it and there is no copy and paste for it. There's none that I could find. But if you simply click on it, then press control C for copy and control V, it will duplicate it. Then click off it and just click the new one. From here, you can rotate this one or move this into a different position. And then I also set this one to a different color. Then you can slice it and you have a preview of how it looks. So there you go. This is how you add a pattern. You can use any type of SVG file. Just make sure that you convert it the same way that's done in this video. Thank you for watching.